Tonight, The Great White Way is singing the Cosmic Blues. A Night with Janis Joplin has arrived on Broadway, starring Mary Bridget Davies as the legendary singer-songwriter. We're here at the Lyceum Theater to rock out on opening night. Right, so what brings you out to A Night with Janis Joplin tonight? My dearest friend, Randy Johnson, he created and directed Janis Joplin. And the next thing I know, we were up in Portland watching the first production, and two and a half years later, on a meteoric journey, it's on Broadway, and it's opening night! Ow. I've been knowing about the show since it started in the regional theaters, and so tonight I get a chance to see what I've been hearing about for the last two years. Oh, I love her music. You know, I, I never saw her live, which I regret. Um, but I listened to her since I was, uh, you know, a, a teenager, and uh, she moved me. Why do you think Janis Joplin is such a legend today? Because she was her own thing. Every, you know, nobody came out before her like that, nobody came out after. Will you please sing one line of Janis Joplin for me? Come Take on! Take another, another little, little piece of my heart, heart now, baby! baby. Oh. Happy opening night, how do you feel right now? It's crazy. Broadway debut. I actually turned around and I was like, oh my god, it's almost over. I was like, add more songs. I didn't want it to end, you know? Like, it was just really, really cool. I feel relieved, happy, exhausted, but I'm on cloud nine. I'm so happy that this all went well. I feel elated and blessed. I, I can't say enough about it. it. It's been a quick process and it's been amazing, you know? It's, it's been such a blessing to get this show, a show that I can sing blues music every night. What was it like to walk out there tonight and just see that cheering crowd? It was so good, and to know that my mom and my family and friends were out there, it was just, it was a dream come true. This stuff you dream about, it was a lot of times, I was about to cry, I feel like I'm about to cry now. Do you feel like this kind of encompasses, you know, the overall vibe and, you know, feel of Janice? Absolutely. Uh, the influence is where the songs came from, watching an artist at work, creating their style and the way they're going to present their own art is really fun to have watched how Janice did it. And you get to see it in the play, her influences, how important they are to her. You are jumping around, you're singing at the top of your lungs for two hours. I mean, how do you do this every day? Um, I was a spaz as a child and I really thank my parents for their patience because I really believe that it takes that temperament and that personality to, to pull her off, because Janice was too. You know, she was very physical, she was very funny, she was very goofy and, and, and wonderful and loving. Mary Bridget knows Janice because she studied her, but she knows her because she's in her heart. I mean, Mary Bridget just has that power, and she uses it really well to bring Janice alive on stage. It's just awesome. It's in her DNA. She was born, it's the role she was born to play. Um, I mean, she's... I, I, she's a star, and stars do that. This is obviously a show about Janis Joplin, but it's not only just about her. I mean, there's these wonderful musical influences. Tell me a little bit about getting to play, though. We celebrate Bessie Smith, Odetta, Nina Simone, Aretha Franklin, who I play, the Queen of Soul, Etta James, so many wonderful artists who really influence music. So it's really a joy to get to actually inhibit them, inhabit them as well. It's so much a part of American history, all of the different influences and how they influenced pop culture and modern day pop music that people may not know about because they were generations ago. So it's nice to pay homage to them and to kind of bring that to light to say, okay, well, this music is popular now, but these are actually where these kind of like songs and ideas came from. If Janice were here tonight, what would you want to say to her? Thank you. Thank you because you changed my life and helped me know that being different was okay. One of her uh, quotes is, don't compromise yourself, you're all you've got. And it's always kind of just been a little public service announcement in my brain my whole life. So I would just thank her very much.